Somalia is facing serious desertification and has just been through devastating long spells of drought. One of the major causes, charcoal trade. The port of Kismayo has long been central to the Somali charcoal business. Once worth some $25 million a year, it has cost Somalia much of its forest cover. Authorities have now launched the National Tree Planting Week intended to encourage the country to go green. There's a village in the north called Gibile. I found pairs of trees along the road. I was told it's a tradition that all married couples plant two trees within the first week of a wedding. I was amazed and inspired. We should all do that. The country's first citizen, the president, planted the first tree. This is a very important week. What we do today would be helpful for the future generations. I encourage all Somalis, wherever they are, in regions, districts and villages, to plant trees. The target is to plant thousands of trees across the country this week to galvanize the green movement. Somalia's environment problems are massive. Some regions in the country have been perennial casualties of floods, while in other parts water points have been reduced to trickle. Experts say it's all caused by the desertification. The drought of 2011 affected people across the Horn of Africa. But Somalia was hardest hit, and four years on, many are still suffering. The country has been through long spells of dry season since. Authorities hope the tree planting campaign will help restore Somalia's forest cover. Mohamed Hirmogi, CCTV, Mogadishu.